Okay, I'm gonna be teaching you how to add your own music to Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. If you haven't already, please make sure to do all the patches stuff so your game is completely modded. If not, I don't think this is method is going to work for you. But in other cases, please make sure that you also download the Lazy Bones tools. I'll leave everything in the description below so you're able to access everything quite easily. Okay, now with that said, when you get Lazy Bone tools, it'll come up as a WinRAR file or a 7-zip file. You want to just right click and extract to wherever. So basically, let's say you were doing it on your desktop, you just extract it here on your desktop. So what we're going to be needing basically is Ace and LB Mod Installer. But first of all, we're going to be using Ace. So we're going to right click on Ace and extract to Ace V and whatever. So we're going to open up Ace, the folder, go into ace.exe and then we're going to click file, new xv2. So basically it's made a new audio file. So now we're going to click new queue. We're going to call this the name of the song. So my song is called Li live and learn euro beat mix. We're going to add the track. So this is going to be our song that we're going to be adding. Mine is on the desktop and here it is here. So we're going to click streaming and loop. We're going to add that here. So now if you want to add another song to your pack, you would click the same thing again. You click new queue and you would name the song whatever you want. Uh, I have an example song here. I'm going to use Mecha Bandicoot. And again, we're going to click loop. So we have two songs in our pack here. So how do we add it to the game? We're going to click tools, dbxv2 installer, and create audio installer. So this is the name of the pack. So we're going to call it tutorial. The author is wave and the type is new options. And the description can be just tutorial. You can put whatever you want in this description. You can put the author, whoever you want, and the name, whatever you want to. This is just the installer package. So we're going to click done. Now here comes the important part. So we're going to put ours on the desktop for now. We're going to call it tutorial. You don't want to change the file extension, by the way. So we're going to click save. And once this comes up, this is good. We're going to click OK. So here's our tutorial file here. And also, if you ever want to come back to this, please make sure to save because it will not open as um, an existing file. So you want to click new, I mean file, save as, you want to click tutorial. So as you can see, it, it creates a new extension as ACB. And basically what this is, it basically lets you reopen this in Ace. If you ever want to add new songs or whatever, you can uninstall your old previous one and re-edit it this way, okay? So we don't need this for now. Now we'll open back up Lazy Bones tools. We want to extract the LB mod installer. So now what we're going to do, I'm going to copy this to where our tutorial files are and we're going to drag them down here. Now I'm going to make a new folder called tutorial just to make it more cleaned up. So our stuff is in here. This is our song. This is our pack. So now what we want to do is edit this and call it tutorial. You want to make sure that it's the same name as our install info file here, unless it's not going to work. So for example, if you was to uh, drag this into here with the LB mod installer.exe is not going to work. It has to be the same name as the install.info. Make sure you've done that. And then you double click the exe and you can see right here it is working. So tutorial installer, tutorial, and now you want to put the directory to your game. So mine, well for you, it might be local disk C, program files 86, Steam, Steam apps, common, and your game might be here as DB's universe too. Now I have a new hard drive, so it's new new volume D, and it's at Steam, Steam apps common, and here are my games. 
Uh, it might be different for you, but most of the time it'll be in local disk program files 86. I just have a new drive where basically all my games are and whatnot. So here is mine and this is where all my stuff is. So you just want to have it as this, um, wherever the game folder is. Then I click next, then next again. And let this install. And then we'll check it out if it works or not. Most of the time it will work though. Unless you didn't do the audio thing, which is this, you need to make sure that you've done this as well. If not, then it definitely probably won't work. Okay, so we're in the game. So to check if your music stuff is working, you want to just click options and then go to uh, music settings. And then whatever you want. And so here it is, the live and learn Eurobeat and the Mecha Bandicoot that we made. And you can just pick, press triangle or Y or whatever to see if they work. Now, you're probably wondering what is the, um, the remix random stuff. Basically it was me trying to make a playlist but it does not work for me. So unfortunately it is what it is. Unless I find out a way on how to do it, I will update you guys on how to make a playlist. I have tried. Um, but it does not succeed. It, basically what happens is it plays all the songs at once in the pack, so... But in any case, I hope this tutorial helps you guys. Basically what I've done as well, I've put all the mods that I've downloaded into its own separate folder. So basically on my new hard drive, I basically made a new folder called dbx2mods and I put all the resources and files into here. So my music background is all here. Um, my music for my girlfriend to see it with these in here um, and all the mods that I have installed is in here and this is one of my packs that I made I didn't re rename it because it's just a personal file for myself um, but yeah it's more better if you did rename the files to a more suited uh, rename so this one I renamed myself um, and did some testing with this but you can see that before I had these songs on the game. They all work, they're all fine. And yeah. So please leave a like, subscribe if you want. Um, I'll try and figure out this playlist thing whenever I can. Um, and yeah, I hope you have I hope you guys have a nice day.